cute little house for sale. It's got some central air down the side right there. I think the roof needs an inspection. <laughs> Actually, I've been kind of looking around at some different places because I'm really that sick of being... <clears throat> <clears throat> word for it. Constantly bedeviled with construction. Got a closed in garage. Like, I know somebody that lives on the street. One car garage. Cute little port. Go around the side. I don't know how much of a yard it's got, but you, know, you wouldn't have to. You wouldn't have to really mow that much. Rick, it's just been painted. Oh, what a cute little patio. Nice. Sweet. The yard does go back a bit, but it's not that bad. Part of it says other people's yard. <laughs> That's just a cute little patio. Where you could have... You know, barbecues out here and put your little table out here. Of course, I'd be up in, I don't know what kind of plants they got. Oh, azalea. Azaleas. These are big old azaleas, some of them. Some of them not. Looks like there used to be maybe some dogwood trees back here, too. Sliding glass doors. It's for sale, so, you know. <laughs> There's not, it, it's not my bad looking at it. <laughs> hardwood floors looks like. A lot of these places that they built back in the day, do you have hardwood floors? I don't have any bathrooms. I'd have to call and ask and guess. <laughs> you might think I'm crazy. What's she doing looking at that house? But, I mean, you know, we have these brick houses all over the place. I mean, this place next door is the same. They're pretty much the same all down the street. And then back up here, it's got, you know, look like at upstairs. It'd be a problem for the old man because he's got, he's got hip replacements. <laughs> so it's not really his thing to have anything with stairs in it. I could go up there and have an artist studio and an <laughs> exercise room. He wouldn't be able to get up there and mess it up. <laughs> Actually, he probably could. I could hide my ill-gotten gains up there, too. <laughs> I'm like, God, this bitch is fucking terrible. All right, let's get around the car. Here's what we got. Look at me. We got Christmas Central over there. <laughs> Those people really did their Christmas. This is a Lennox Elite. Now, check it out. That's a good brand right there. Because I've got a uh, Lennox furnace under my house. I don't not I have window units. I don't have central air, but it's been there before I moved there in 96. And it's still kicking, which is, you know, and we've got gas in this place. It's sweet. Man. It's actually nice. This neighborhood looks nice. It's kind of, I'm not sure what that these might be camellias. I think that they are. Yeah, look, see? Look at this. There's some kind of camellia. Porch. It's got gutters. You gotta get your ass up there and clean some gutters. Or else everybody knows what happens <laughs> if you don't <laughs> to your roof. Oh. oh, look, man, a really sweet kitchen with an island and all that stuff. And it's perfect for just two people. That's just nice. Nice porch. You can sit out here. Of course, it's only downside. We're a, a block from a, a, a major highway over there. Which, uh, a little further on down the road, someone was run over down there. 
that road right there. Uh, down by my pawn shop. Go ahead north. Not near me. Oh well, that was sad. Anyway, but yeah, this is a cute place, man. Porch on the front, porch on the back. Nice. <clears throat> Little sidewalk right here. Nice room for one car. Go inside, I could go inside there with my groceries and actually not. <laughs> have to have water all over me. <laughs> yeah, my brother in law was saying, why don't we move into their neighborhood? <laughs> See, there's there's trouble when you get a roof with with the colors that, that one's got. You know, my advice if you're looking you're thinking of a house specifically, don't pass up on the inspection. Anyway, that was fun.